Hey guys, welcome back. Modi101 here, and we're back in the world of Infinity Skyblock Evolved. And I've been doing a little bit of work in between episodes, annoyingly. As you can see, we got ourselves a whole crushing situation. So, went back to these, which is kind of getting backed up because of these. Because you have stuff like that that doesn't stack right. Whatever. So, but as you can see, we're getting some blocks coming in, which is pretty cool. The nice thing with gravel is pretty much all of the blocks can be uh, can be blocked up, if you will. Um, but as you can see, they're kind of getting loaded. So, what I want to start working on, as you can see, we got ourselves some destabilized redstone, some resin ender and of course the glowstone from before what i want to start working on is a couple of things but before that so i've gotten i think two or three ink sacks that's it but that thing just spawns slimes like crazy so apparently we inadvertently made ourselves a spawn a slime spawner but i was able to get i was able to kill i think two and there was a few ink sacks just laying down in there so we are good to go, and for some reason, one of my water wheels, once again, had disappeared, so. All right, so let's jump to it. What I want to work on this episode is conduits. Now, we did a little bit of work. We made a few energy conduits, but they were quite a headache, but we need to keep going. I need, I want, I want to get some item conduits, and a lot of you guys are telling me to use the, the ducks and stuff. I just don't like them as much, so. What we're going to start doing is getting ourselves some of these. So first of all, we need to get ourselves some Enderium. To do that, we're going to need some Enderium base, which is tin, silver, and shiny. If you look, I've already done that. I've already gotten our Enderium base. So the other things we need is we need to make Pyrothium. And some ender pearls. I have been killing mobs in the mob spawner. It actually does pretty good on endermen. I'm, I'm very pleased with that. But we need to make some pyrothium dust. So we need some coal powder, some sulfur, some blaze powder, and some of this electrotine. As you can see, I've got the, that, the coal powder. And then over here, we've got ourselves some electrotine. We've got ourselves some blaze powder. And we've got ourselves some sulfur. All right. So let's go ahead and make up a, a bunch of this real quick. Like so. Boom. Entire stack. Big fan. Okay. So we also are going to need some ender pearls. And like I said, it's been going decently. We've got 42. Let's go ahead and grab two stacks for now. And let's head on over to this bad boy. And go ahead and pop in that, that, and that. It will not let me put in the other ones. Why is it not going? Okay. So it looks like it's going to run just a scoop slow. All right. So uh, to, we're also going to want to make these. So we're going to want a tin plates, glass, and hardened glass. Hardened glass is, pulver, is obsidian, powder, dust, whatever, and lead. Okay. Um, with the obsidian, though, we can use this. And actually, if we grind it up, we get that. But if we regrind this, we actually get some more. So I've been doing that a little bit. And as you can see, we've got ourselves six hardened glass. I thought we had more than that. Maybe we're going to need to get more. We got some regular glass. Um, I thought I had more hardened glass. Maybe not. Oh, that's why. Okay. So let's put that back in there. Let's go ahead and grab ourselves a little bit of lead. Now, nah, that's a lot. Let's grab like 16, I think is what we had. 13, whatever. All right, and then... Jesus Christ, that thing scared me. Um, I don't have an induction smelter. I actually need to use this. Oh, God, that scares me every damn time. So you can see it's the same thing for the two in here. This bad boy is making this right now. So let's go ahead and start with what we have. And we need 10 plates, which I did run through the machine. As you can see, we got a pretty decent amount. Let's see how many of these 
we can make. We're trying to go for quantity here. So, boom. Why didn't that work? Because i got to make the first part first. I'm smart. Because I have a couple reasons for these. Right, that gives us 18. And then this gives us 18. Good, good. Uh, then we just need some of these, which we're actually going to need some more of the glass. So we're kind of waiting on that. But we are going to need some redstone. And we are going to need, let's just grab a stack of nuggets. Okay. All right, so we got those. Shut up. What else do we need? And we got the conduit binder because we did make a pretty decent amount of that. There's some. And then, see, because you got to see, each piece cooks up into, I think it's eight or four or something. Yeah, four. Usually, in most mod packs, it's eight. So we're good there. All right, so while we're waiting on that, let's go ahead and check out these as well. We're, for these, we're going to need these types of fluid ducts, which is going to be some more hardened glass. So we're definitely going to have to get going. Copper plates and regular glass. And then we're going to need basically these normal servos, which is actually pretty easy to make. And I think we have... No, those are filters. I thought maybe we had some servos made, but we must have used them. Oh, wait, what's this? There's my hardened glass. I knew I made more than just six. Okay. Never mind. We're good. Okay. I was like, I sat here and made a bunch, but maybe I didn't. I really second-guessed myself, so. All right. So let's finish making some of these. Boop. That gives us four, and this will give us a grand total of six of those. So we are going to need a little bit more of that. Let's kind of keep this going. Let's go ahead and throw this in there. I do have a purpose for this stuff. Uh, so while we're waiting on that, let's go ahead and make up some of these. So we're going to need copper, which I need some more of, the hardened glass and glass, which we have. So let's go ahead and grab our copper plates. Mm -mm -mm, mm -mm -mm. All right. And we're going to want these, which involve these. Boop. Uh, let's go ahead, and that's probably way more than enough. Okay, what do we need for these? Do we have everything? No. Uh, where'd it go? Stop moving on me. Where? Come here. All right, so iron nuggets, iron, redstone. I just need some iron, I think. There we go. All right, and let's make up some more of these. Uh, that should probably be more than enough for what we're going to need. All right, and boom. There we go. So we got that now. Perfect. <coughs> so that gives us those. We're still doing decently on these to make more of these. Let's go check on our Enderium. Pull that out, pop those last ones in, and see how many more of these we can make. So not only do I want to use these for um over here i want to use these instead of not only these pipes but those hoppers and maybe even those hoppers those ones are okay uh because i wanted to be able to pull the stuff out right and but that is not the main purpose of why we're making these but i will keep that for another moment what am i missing I have the warp pipes. Okay, so I'm just missing some more of these. So another six. That gives us another... Okay, and now we're at 15. Now we're doing good. All right, the last thing I wanted to see if I can make before we start setting up is the reservoir. Let's see how big of a headache this is. Oh, they kept it original. So glass. We are going to need some fused glass. But not much. We're only going to need four pieces of fused glass. So the question is, do we have any... Oh, wow, I have a lot more of that stuff. Do we... Why do I have iron plates in here? Stop talking. Do we have any nether quartz without going to the nether? I highly, highly doubt it. So we're going to kind of start this process a little early. So what I want to do is I want to grab a few of these, okay? And then we're also going to make ourselves up 
some barrels. So let's go ahead and... I only have four wood planks. Let's go ahead and grab a stack of that. Do I have any slabs pre-made? I saw those ones down there. Let's grab these and these. And let's go ahead and we'll convert... Oh yeah, it doesn't do it as much. Alright, so here and there plus this gives us 10 barrels. That should probably be good. Alright, so what we're going to do now is we're going to put these away. We're going to put this away. We're going to grab just a stack of this. And then we're going to come, and I'm thinking right here might be a good area. So, we'll do that, and then we'll go one, two, three, four, five. Come out a little bit more. There we go. Let's hit F7 just to make sure there's nothing wonky going on. We'll do it like this. Perfect. Okay, so now we just need to get ourselves just a little bit of dirt, just 10 pieces. That's all we're going to worry about now. And 10. Perfect. And then we are going to set some dirt. And I'm sure a lot of you guys know exactly what we're doing. And even though I know the spread, I really don't care because I have a ton of them and I will always get more. I literally just want this to be done. Okay, so now we're going to take our barrels. I'm going to put it down like this. We're going to come over here with our little trusty pickaxe. I showed you earlier that I was filling up a drum with water. This is why, but this is just temporary. So we're going to stick that down there. We're going to go ahead and grab our bucket. And we're just going to fill all of these up. And I'm sure any of you guys that are even slightly familiar with mod packs know exactly what's going on. But just in case, let me fill these up and I'll explain. So we have mycelium down on the ground. We have barrels sitting on top of them with water inside. As you can see, the water is getting darker as time goes on. The reason is it is turning into witch water. So we take that witch water, we come right over here, we grab ourselves, uh, let's go ahead and grab ourselves, we'll go for a solid 10 right now. We come over here and we fill up these guys with sand. You notice it's kind of red and that's because it is soul sand. That is an easy way to get soul sand. Now if we come over here and we sieve the aforementioned soul sand, start to get some items and hopefully if what's coming up is what I think it is it is going to help in something that we just talked about making all right and if you notice we're getting nether quartz sweet home Alabama all right but I am not just content with the concept of us just filling those things up. So that is the other side we're going to do. So what we're going to do while we're waiting, we're going to grab ourselves one stack of gravel and we are going to pop it in the old pulverizer and just let it be. All right, so now that we have that, let's go ahead and pop back, that's not it, to our reservoir where we needed to make some fused glass. We need four, so we're going to need probably more than what we have. But let's go ahead. It looks like we're just about done with what we're doing. Let's pull this out. And let's go ahead and pop this in. I get a feeling we're going to have to do another set. Let's kind of clean things up just a scooch. Let's go ahead and throw these in here. Um, we'll throw this in there. We don't need that right now. We don't need that right now. And I'm sure these things have a place. I uh, don't need that right now. And we'll go ahead and put these nuggets away. And you know what? Just for the heck of it, let's go ahead and put away a lot of these items that we don't need. Oh, I also got nether, uh, nether wart, as you may have noticed. I just noticed. And nether wart. Sweet. All right. Let's actually put this here because I will lose it. And we'll put this, uh, we'll put this back over here. Okay. 
So I'll sink a little gander in here. We'll get this going. So that took six of them. Let's hope this makes what I want. And that gives us two pieces. So unfortunately, we need a little bit more. So let's go ahead and grab ourselves ten more pieces of sand, right? And our handy-dandy little bucket here. And let's go ahead and fill these back up like so. Perfect. 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 And perfect. And one more perfect. Perfect. Okay. And by the time we got to the end, the front should have been done. Just making sure it says which water. That one just finished. We're waiting just a little bit on these two. We're at 90%. Why is that dropping so many saplings? Why are you wasting saplings? Come here. Take this. Stop! Yeah, he'll take care of it. Give me that. Come here, you. Take, take those. All right. And boom, and boom. Okay. So let's get this. Let's see this stuff up real quick. Real quick-like. See if we can get a little bit more. If we can get... Actually, the same number as we got last time. We should be good to go. We've got a few more minutes in this episode. I think we're going <coughs> to finish making up the pieces, and then we are going to get into just a drop of automation. All right. And I, would, I do want to look up one more thing before we go, just to see if the recipe has dramatically changed. And boom. Okay, and that gave us 17, actually, way better. So now, uh, what was it? 11, so it was 8. Let's pop that in there. That should take that. Uh, what I wanted to look... All right, we're back. I'm just hitting buttons and all kinds of dumb stuff. I don't know what the hell happened, but okay, we're back. Sorry about that little hiccup. I'm dumb. Okay, I just wanted to look up one quick thing, and it was filter, and it's uh, upgrade, okay, selects only items already in the inventory, right click, okay, so I think it's this one, so this is a little tricky here, advanced item filter, so yeah, to make these filters, we would have to get into a slice and splice, so that may be something we do fairly soon but not quite so alrighty so we got this let's go ahead and finish this up do I have my glass on me I do uh, reservoir. Uh, I need two cauldrons wait let's see they might be weirdly made they probably with plates yep I knew it all right we had some iron plates in here perfect so let's go ahead and make ourselves up a couple of cauldrons, like so. Perfect. And then let's uh, go ahead and make this bad boy. Where'd it go? Right here. So we actually have to make two sets. So we're going to take this, and we're going to stick this right there. As you can see, it becomes a multi-block structure. And we take a bucket of water, we fill it up. Nothing. Second bucket, boom. And unlimited water supply a very more tech so now we don't need this anymore we can stick this back over here like uh, so there we go and let that bad boy start filling back up for when it is needed <coughs> all right so I think we're gonna wrap things up there we are going to hook this up and automate it here in the next episode. Plus, I think we're going to attempt to try and make that void pipe we were trying to make a couple episodes ago. And maybe we'll even hook these things up more correctly and get rid of all this garbage. So, All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you hit that thumbs up. Questions, comments, concerns, put them down in the comments section. If you need to get yourself your own Minecraft server, make sure you head over to Aim to Game. Click the link down below so that you they know you're from the Modi Army. You're a little one of Modi's little monsters. And, uh, yeah. and oh, I hurt myself. And, yeah, make sure you get yourself... Um, a sweet server and use the coupon codes to save yourself some money and yeah until the next episode of infinity skyblock evolved i want to thank you guys so much for hanging out we'll see you guys next time bye